Welcome to another InMotion Hosting video tutorial. My name is Arnel Custodio, and today we will be stepping through how to reset the WordPress permalinks. We will first discuss the definition of permalinks, their importance, and the steps needed to reset them. What's the definition of a permalink? The permalink is the URL used by WordPress for your posts and pages. It consists of your domain name and a slug. Why are permalinks important? Permalinks are important because the URL or slugs for your site can change, and this affects your website content. The URLs for pages or posts are often cached or saved in the WordPress database. So a common troubleshooting step for WordPress is to reset your permalinks. You can see the permalink for your page or post in the right-hand column where it's labeled Permalink. You can also see the different types of preset permalinks that WordPress provides in Settings. Go to Settings, then click on Permalinks. Remember, before you make a change to your permalinks, either make sure that you have a complete backup of your WordPress site, or make a note of the permalink that you're using. If you are using a custom structure, make sure to record the one that you're using before resetting your permalinks. The common settings for permalink include plain, day and name, month and name, numeric, post name, and custom structure. Having easily readable permalinks can help make your site more friendly for your viewers. The optional section at the bottom of the permalink settings page is for labeling your category and tag URLs. For example, if you want your categories to have a slug of topics, then you would type topics in the category base field. The URL used when you click on a category like uncategorized would be https colon forward slash forward slash example dot com slash topics slash uncategorized. In order to reset your permalinks, you just have to select a different setting other than your current one and save it. There is no reset button. Saving a different type forces the URLs to be updated. You can use the plain option at the top to reset your permalinks. Select it, then click on Save Changes. If you are already using the plain option, you can click on any other of the common settings provided by WordPress. Reload your site in your browser and take a look at your pages or posts. You need to see if the URLs have changed per your new permalink settings. If you see the change, then you know that the permalinks have been reset. Once you've confirmed that they have been reset, you can go back in and set them to what you really want to use. Make sure to click on the Save Changes button at the bottom when you're done with all your changes. That completes our tutorial on resetting your WordPress permalinks. We hope you liked our video. If you did, please give us a thumbs up below and subscribe to our channel. Thanks again for listening and have a great day. Check out our InMotion Hosting Support Center for help with your website. We provide thousands of step-by-step -step guides, videos, and much more to lead you towards making your online project a successful one. You can find us at www.inmotionhosting.com support.